Hello everybody, thank you for taking the time to watch this introduction to Indusoft Web Studio. Today we're going to be talking about Indusoft Web Studio and, and just what is it and how can it help you be more efficient in your plant or process, uh, whatever you might be using it for. Uh, it's an easy to use yet still very powerful and, and affordable HMI and SCADA software product for use in, in PCs, industrial panels, embedded and mobile devices, but it's so much more than that. Uh, we were founded in 1997 and now we're part of Schneider Electric Software. Uh, we still have a very customer focused culture. We listen to customers and we add new features typically based on, on customer input. Uh, we were the first in the industry to have a package built on Windows CE. And why do you care about that? Well, it helps keep our code base very efficient and very performance oriented. Uh, we've got a patent for our database connectivity. And uh, we've really got uh, a lot of features that are kind of cutting edge these days related to multi-touch support and the fact that we can uh, have HTML5 built into the product so that uh, you can see it on iPads and, and tablets and Android and phones and, and remote devices and things of that nature. Uh, we feel very proud about some of the awards that we've won. Now, the, some of these that are listed here are based on voting from actual readership as opposed to advertising dollars spent, so we're very proud about that. And the package is really more than, than just an HMI or SCADA software. It's very flexible and can be deployed in different applications or different architectures than, than you might find traditional HMI or SCADA. It can be used for and on and production monitoring, uh, building automation, energy automation, and uh, with with uh, recently our bringing on of, of Linux and VxWorks runtimes, now we can have the Internet of Things and IIoT, or also known as Industry 4.0 uh, type architectures, uh, as well as many templates uh, we have available, things like PacML and OEE and some business uh, intelligence dashboards, things of that nature, are available for the product as well. But it can do so much more than just your traditional HMI and SCADA software. We're in a lot of different markets. I like to point out that uh, this rightmost and others is probably the biggest one because we're not only in these uh, industries, we're in really every industry that you can imagine. Why does this matter to you? We, t we tend to build the, the features into the product that customers ask us for and make those available for everybody. For example, the pharmaceutical uh, industry and some customers asked us to build in features for uh, a United States uh, FDA um, uh, 21 CFR Part 11. So if you're not familiar with that, that's security and traceability in your project. So we added that in and made that available to to everybody. So that's the kind of idea that, that we have in this product. And it's, it's really a complete feature set is included. So everything that you need to build an HMI or SCADA type package uh, for for your environment is, is included. So I'm not going to read through this list, but uh, over 250 drivers are included. Uh, we'll talk about OPC in a minute, and really everything that you can imagine that you need uh, in the product is is av av available. Um, shown here on the right is a, a snapshot of the front page of our data sheet, and that's set up in alphabetical order. So if you have a question, you can take a look at that and see uh, if, if what you need in an HMI and SCADA software product is in there. So feel free to download that from our website. Uh, today and, and sometimes it's a little things that count things like uh, there's a built-in PDF writer or the ability to to, to to go to an FTP site and, and grab files redundancy is built in and expandability so for example ActiveX and .NET you can grab third-party uh, objects and put them right into the screens within Indusoft Web Studio uh, the ability to keep different versions uh, concurrently installed. So if you've got uh, customers that like to stay on their version, uh, you can still support those uh, uh, customers. Uh, online configuration with automatic runtime updates. So uh, you don't have to shut down the runtime to update it. You can stay connected to it. And, and when you save your screen, it automatically gets updated over there. Troubleshooting tools are a really nice tool uh, too in this product. One tool is the built-in protocol analyzer that's uh, very, very handy for for communications and, and uh, uh, analyzing that. Multi-touch gestures are enabled with just a checkbox. So rotate, pinch and zoom, and panning objects uh, on the screen, very easy to configure, as well as import wizards for, for bringing in um, uh, third-party applications and, and uh, um, making use of those. 
the, the product is very scalable. One of the great features of the product is, is several ways that it's scalable. Resolution. So for example here, uh, if you want to bring a screen from let's say uh, 640 by 480 to 1024 by 768 you literally just have to check a checkbox that says auto scale that and and all the objects and all the screens and the graphics will will automatically scale there is however a conversion tool so you can go from any resolution to any resolution if you want to uh, it's operating system scalable as well. We'll talk about that in a second. And you can go from low-end to high-end hardware, give you or your customers the flexibility of the hardware that they need to fit the application. So when we talk about scalable for operating system, uh, you can develop uh, one project and deploy it on really any Windows operating system and often without any changes uh, including Windows CE, Windows Embedded and, and even Linux and VX works. Uh, uh, sometimes you won't even need any changes at all for that. So really this gives you and your customers the flexibility to have one project and maybe developed a standard uh, uh, offering, a high-end offering, and a low-end offering, and deployed on different operating systems, different size screens, different uh, resolutions, and the flexibility to deploy that to, in, in many different ways. And we also have uh, this, for example, is, is how you would do that. Indusoft Web Studio, the full version is deployed on uh, any desktop or uh, server Windows operating system and then we have other licenses as well for embedded view CE view and now we also have what's called IOT view uh, to, to highlight the Internet of Things market for Linux and VX works and what's really nice is you can use the Indusoft Web Studio development environment to develop your project once and deploy it on any of these licenses uh, so that that is very very handy for uh, uh, you don't have to keep track of multiple projects and, and seamlessly uh, deploy that to different runtimes. The connectivity is unparalleled in this product. We have over uh, 200 and I think we're over 250 drivers now to communicate to really just about any PLC that you can find in the world but much more than that. You can also uh, communicate uh, OPC uh, as well as to web interfaces, TCP IP, uh, and, and in addition to being an OPC client, we can also be an OPC server, so third-party applications can get at the Indusoft tags as well. Our database connectivity is very easy to use, and if you're not a SQL programmer, you don't need to know SQL to deploy many of the features in the product, but if you do know SQL and want to be a power user, you can do that as well. Uh, again, I mentioned there's over 250 drivers included, uh, but OPC can be used as well. It's not required, uh, but clients uh, are included. Clients such as OPC DA, uh, also known as OPC Classic, uh, OPC UA, which is platform independent and, and now being promoted by the OPC Foundation is kind of their, their platform of choice, uh, as well as Indusoft Web Studio also supports OPC XML and OPC.NET. There is also an OPC DA server, as I mentioned, and uh, OPC UA server is planned in the future. And, and one of the things you need to remember is that devices other than PLCs are supported as well. So not just PLCs, things like barcode readers, RFID, temperature controllers, motion, etc. And if I go back a slide here, one of the great things about this product is, for example, you can communicate from one PLC to another just by putting the tag name in the two different driver sheets and it will automatically communicate from one brand of PLC to another brand of PLC or from a PLC to uh, uh, an OPC server or even to the database. So uh, this product can act as much as a, a gateway from any of these devices to any of these other communications uh, technologies as well. So moving along We've got an installed base of, uh, actually we're over 270,000 now, we're approaching 300,000 uh, licenses now installed, so uh, we've got a great installed base, and there's some great case studies available, uh, kind of testimonials on our website. Feel free to take a look at those and download those uh, depending on your industry, but you don't have to look at just your industry. There's some real good examples how different industries have used Indusoft to solve their problems uh, and, and streamline their, their application in, in much better ways than they ever thought possible. Uh, Indusoft Web Studio it has what 
what's called investment protection. Uh, I can attest to this because before I was an employee, I was actually a customer of Indusoft, and I helped develop a project uh, in the late 90s that uh, uh, recently uh, that customer came back to us and said, hey, we'd like to take advantage of the new features in version 8. And uh, so we, we uh, upgraded them and uh, deployed some new features with them over the Christmas uh, holiday and uh, everything ran 100% and uh, came in just fine. So that that application really used all the features back then that were available in the product such as alarming, trending, recipes, reports, security, database connectivity and all of that came in and, and ran without a hitch 100% uh, uh, in the current version as well. So uh, evolve and, and protect your investment rather than like some of our competitors that uh, replace their product every few years with an incompatible version and, and uh, uh, the, uh, make it repeat uh, your, your development for that. Uh, database we can really communicate to any SQL uh, relational database. Could be Microsoft SQL Server, Oracle, MySQL, Sybase, FoxPro, uh, even historians such as OSI Pi. We can treat Microsoft Access and Excel as databases and, and really communicate with uh, just about anything that you could imagine uh, related to uh, SQL. The, the interfaces are standard, so that we're using standard technologies to communicate to these databases. And why is that important? Because if you need to switch technologies, um, the SQL stays uh, uh, the same and consistent, and uh, you, you very often wouldn't have to change your code. Um, the uh, alarm uh, object, the event object, the trend, uh, and certain process history and our grid object and things of that nature, you don't need to know SQL to be able to use those objects and those features. Uh, you just point it to which database you want to go to, which table, which field, and it automatically will create the table, automatically can create the database if you need to, and uh, be able to get in there and, and send that data where you need to, if, even if you don't know uh, SQL. Uh, built in also is redundancy and store and forward features. Uh, again, that's often just a checkbox and set up where the secondary database is and, and away you go. Uh, also in the product are thin clients. Now thin clients are a way to remotely view uh, your screens and interact. Uh, we have three different types depending on your technology the, the needed. The, the web thin client is often used in an office environment. You can open up Internet Explorer, point it to the HMI on the plant floor and view and interact with those screens uh, with security in mind. Then we have another uh, uh, thin client called Secure Viewer that you might use to uh, uh, have on the machine, maybe it's a large machine or a long machine, and have uh, uh, additional HMIs, and, and really it looks and views and interacts just like it's another HMI, uh, but built off of uh, using the screens and data of the, the main HMI. Um, in addition to that, Secure Viewer clients are, are very often used in uh, production monitoring and and-on monitoring, putting them on large screens uh, up in the, the rafters, and, and you can have uh, a lot of these uh, out on your plant floor and again based off of the uh, the main HMI. Uh, the third type is Studio Mobile Access, often referred to as SMA. And, and this is kind of our flagship of where we're going within clients. Uh, this can be uh, viewed on Windows, on Android, on, on Apple, on Linux, and really it's using HTML5 technology. And the fact that you can open up, for example, Internet Explorer 11 or Chrome or Safari on iPads, uh, uh, even iPhones or Android tablets and phones, and view and, again, optionally interact with those screens with security in mind, uh, remotely is uh, a great thing to keep uh, operators and maintenance staff uh, very efficient. Now we have lots of different licensing options. We go from 150 tags up to 10 million tags and the thing that's really nice is the feature set that's included at 10 million tags is the same feature set that's included at 150 tags. So you don't lose out at the, uh, on the feature set uh, even if you're just going to a small tag count. Now the number of simultaneous drivers that's listed here, that's not the number of PLCs, that's the number of protocols. So for example, if you have a local interface uh, with 1,500 tags and three simultaneous drivers, you could communicate to, for example, a Beckoff PLC, an Omron PLC, and an Allen Bradley PLC all simultaneously, or multiple of those PLCs on each of those networks, uh, depending on how many uh, PLCs on a given network that uh, will be supported by that protocol. Um, 
moving on uh, you know the product is is a, a very competitive product and, and you know really what you're looking at is uh, the ability to support different hardware platforms different size screens different uh, the manufacturers things of that nature and it's it's open architecture really allows uh, this to be done to different uh, systems different databases different PLCs controllers things of that nature productivity you know it, really when you're running a, a, a process or a manufacturing environment, uh, you're you're really using that to to make whatever you're making and make money doing it. So uh, if there's a problem, get it going again quickly. Uh, and if there's no problem, keep the, the machine running or the process running. And using alarming and trending and things of that nature can really help uh, do that. This product is a very cost efficient uh, product. It's, it's one of the most cost efficient tools in the market. Uh, give us a, a, a contact. Contact us, give us a call, check us out on our website, and uh, let us help you find the right solution for, for what you're looking for with this type of product. Uh, as uh, you can imagine, our management has made customer service a priority. We get lots of compliments on uh, customer service and, and feedback from uh, many, many, many of our customers. So, uh, How can you contact us? We'd love you to do that. Um, we know your time is important, so we want to make this as efficient as possible. Uh, you can uh, contact us, our sales group at info at indusoft.com uh, or any of these other uh, company uh, country uh, websites as well uh, get a hold of us on our website uh, different email address you can phone us or you can do live chat on our website check out our Facebook page uh, and other social media we have lots of training videos on our website our entire five-day training class is available on the website for free uh, our symbol libraries we're expanding all the time on our website we have a symbol of the week program and uh, just let us know if there's anything that we can do if you have some simple questions let us know we'd love to help you out thanks for your time and have a great day